Hello all, welcome back to my YouTube channel. Today I'm back with an interesting uh, topic, Oracle Certification Delta exam. A uh, couple of months back, I've created uh, a couple of videos on how to prepare for uh, different uh, certification, uh, Fusion Cloud certification exams. So I got a very good uh, response from a lot of my subscribers saying that uh, those videos helped them a lot in uh, preparing for the uh, their uh, certification exam. So in those uh, videos, I covered uh, the uh, exam pattern, the number of questions asked, uh, the passing score, uh, the topics which are covered in the exam and so on. And uh, recently, Oracle has come up with something called uh, Delta exam. So uh, that was in April 2023. So I thought maybe uh, I'll create a video on this topic as well so that it would be useful for my subscribers. So to get into the details of what is Delta exam, so most of us are aware that whenever you write uh, any Oracle certification exam, be it say general ledger implementation specialist, uh, payable special cloud implementation specialist, receivable special cloud implementation specialist, and so on, generally those certifications are valid for 18 months from the date of writing of the exam. And uh, of course, those exams are not uh, free, so you need to pay a fee for that. It's $245 per exam, and the exam is valid only for 18 months. So in the past, once the exam, uh, the certification uh, expires, then you need to rewrite the exam by paying again $245. But recently Oracle has come up with something called uh, Delta exam. That is on or before your certification, or rather not on. So I think before your certification expires, you have an opportunity to write a Delta exam and when you write your delta exam, again, the delta exam would be valid for another 18 months from the date you write your uh, uh, delta exam. So the prerequisite for delta exam is you, you should have passed the main base exam. Now getting into the details of what is this delta exam is about. Delta exam is about again writing the same, you are say taking a say payables uh, implementation specialist uh, certification example. So it's writing the same exam, but it will not be a full blown exam. It be a very uh, simple and a short exam. And now when I get into the details, again, it's same as your base exam, but this is online proctored exam. Uh, in the main exam, there are, I think earlier, it used to be like 60 questions were being asked, but as far as the Delta exam is concerned, uh, only the, the questions which are asked is 25. The total time is uh, 60 minutes, passing score is 76 percent so that means out of 25 you should have passed um, you should have uh made correct uh, answers for at least uh, 19 questions format is multiple choice questions and again this exam validity the exam is valid again for 18 months so take an example uh if i had written my uh, say uh payables exam in say december 2022 then my uh, payables uh, certification is valid until June 2024. So that means before June 2024, I have an option to write the Delta exam. And once I write the Delta exam, which would be a simple, uh, wherein only 25, 25 questions uh, needs to be answered, uh, the the exam uh, the the certification would be valid for another 18 months. And another good thing is uh, the fee for Delta exam is only 125 dollars compared to the main base exam where it is 200. $45. And as far as the exam topics are concerned, uh, the focus is more on the new features which are introduced recently, as well as uh, some core concepts as well. Uh, how And how to check if my base exam certification is expert. So now I'll, I'll log into your certview.oracle.com. I'll actually show my certification by navigating to, to uh, uh, this. And then I'll show you whether I am eligible to write this Delta exam, okay. So let me get into your yeah, certview.oracle.com. So once I get try to uh, get into certview.oracle.com, this is what uh, it shows in your browser. So under your certview.oracle.com, you can go to your credential management and then go to share credentials. So in my case, I'm just taking one example, say I'll take uh, say tables an example. I have written my tables fusion cloud implementation specialist uh, exam in uh, yeah December 2022. And it says its current status is active. And if I go and click on print, so here you can see 
I have written my exam on December 23rd, 2022, and this certificate is valid until June 23rd, 2024. So that means before June 23rd, 2024, I will have an option to write Delta exam by paying $125 and getting the a fresh certification, which will be valid for another 18 months. And obviously there is no point in, now it's like uh, we are in say September, 2023. So there is no point in writing this Delta exam now. So I'll be writing a Delta exam, maybe probably in the month of say uh, April or May, 2024. Now with regard to how we can register for the Delta exam, it will be same as your main year base exam. So you can go to your mylearn.oracle.com and say, let me see, in this case, I'll just say Delta Pables. So you can see Delta exam preparation certif uh, certified Pables implementer. So if you go here, I'll just say register now. So here you can see, this is the Delta exam, Oracle Financial Cloud Pables 2023 implementation professional Delta. Duration is 60 minutes. Number of questions is 25. Passing score is 76%. And I, as I mentioned, like you can even go to uh, Oracle Serve you to check if your certification credential is expired or is it still valid. So as I mentioned in my uh, current case, my certification is valid until 23rd June 2024. So that means I will have an option to write Delta exam before June 23rd, 2024. Of course, you'll also get an auto-generated email from Serve you uh, whenever you are uh, license is about to expire and but just in case even if you miss that email and if you do not uh, write this delta exam before in my example like before june 23 2024 then i need to write the base exam once again by paying 245 dollars so now let's see if i click on schedule exam see in my case it says when i try to click on schedule an exam you must buy an exam attempt or schedule your exam before June 23rd to 2024, because that's the date on which my current base exam expires. So I can click on continue and I can start scheduling the exam. Okay. So this is the significance of uh, Delta exam. So I hope uh, you got a good information on this uh, video about uh, uh, Delta exam. Thank you.